Hi everyone, this is Dave from Geekanoids and this is my continued coverage of the Arcos 70 internet tablet. Now if you saw my previous video, I did an unboxing and product tour for you. But in this video I'm going to be covering off the gaming performance of this little tablet. Now this is a 7 inch device, we've got a nice 7 inch screen here. And it's also packing a 1 gigahertz processor, 256 megabytes of RAM. Well I've got some games installed on here and from my last video you also notice I've also installed Android Market. Now that doesn't come as standard on the Arcos 70, that's something that I installed via an APK file. So the two games I'm going to show you today is Raging Thunder and Angry Birds. Let's kick things off with Angry Birds, one of my favourite games at the moment on the Android platform. Let's just pop this down a second. As you can see, really nice screen on this Arcos 70. Really pleased with it. Uh, very vivid colours. Uh, the only thing I probably don't like is just the overlay of the touchscreen buttons here. But that said, it's a very, very nice screen. So let's tap on play. And then on this first level, this is the first play I've had of this on this new tablet. So uh, we have to just wait while this intro plays through. Really nice gaming experience on this device though. And the touch screen is capacitive, so it's very sensitive to the touch. So here we are, loaded the first level. And the idea of Angry Birds is to... Um, get rid of these little snorty critters here uh, little green pigs with the birds and we drag the catapult back and then let go and it starts off very easy but does progressively get difficult very addictive game now back to the arc or 17 how this is performing the sounds very good the screen equally as good and the motion very fluid like in the motion you can obviously pinch to zoom on Angry Birds as well. And we're on another level here, so let's do this one for you. And we've got one more to get. Oh, did we get it? Yes, we did. There we go, so you get the idea of Angry Birds, and this isn't about the game, this is to show you the actual performance of the Arcos 70. So let's go out to our main home screen again, and we've got Raging Thunder. This was one of the pre-installed games on the tablet. We're going to enable sound, and this is one that uses the accelerometer in the tablet, so I'm going to have to pick this up to play this one. So we're going to tap start, single player quick race and here we go so we're using the accelerometer to drive it's quite sensitive actually this is my first play on this I haven't been practicing auto accelerate missed my boost there quite difficult playing this through a, a lens of a, a camera, through the screen of my camera. So overall, a really nice um, sort of speed. This one gigahertz processor we got is, is performing well. We've got no sort of drawing problems with the uh, graphics on the screen. We've got no glitches. So yeah, very, very good performance on the gaming front. Okay, well let's pause this, a little pause here, and we go back to the menu. So this uh, Raging Thunder, yeah, nice game, nice performance on the graphics. Let's go back out to our home screen. Now, I wasn't going to cover Android Market in this one, but I just do want to give you a quick look at the two different choices you've got. When you buy an Arcos 70, you've got AppsLib pre-installed. Now, I've been trying to get this to work all morning, and I can't get the AppsLib interface to do any more than just go through uh, this sort of startup sequence. I have left it going for quite a while but it doesn't seem to want to uh, to load anything. I can tap on categories there, nothing at all. So what I actually did was I downloaded the Google Market APK file from Arcos fans website and the Android Market, if I go back out to the main home screen, 
we can browse through the games it loads very quickly and I can basically download anything that's available on the Android market so very worthwhile doing if, if you feel confident doing this put the APK file on a micro SD card and install it onto your machine and then you can gain access to all of the lovely games that are available in Android market so I would definitely do this I'm not impressed at all with apps lib uh, I just can't seem to get anything out of it so thank you very much for watching this brief video on gaming on the Arcos 70 this particular one was sent to me by advanced mp3 players and you can find their website at amp3.co.uk it's going to cost you £229 for the 8GB version in the UK they're very hard to come by at the moment stock is getting better on a day by day basis so do please check out amp3.co.uk thanks very much for listening please come back soon and check out more video reviews on the Geekanoid channel this video is sponsored by MyMemory.com. For great prices, fast delivery and reliable customer support, visit MyMemory.com.